everyone, Tim Stoddard here. And in this week's video, I am going to show you the exact system I created in order to monetize business directories. I did a podcast a couple months ago on the Niche Pursuits podcast, and I talked about the, the web directory businesses I've created. Um, I will link that podcast in the description of the video, and I will also link a previous video I made about how to build a profitable directory. But in this week's video, I'm going to show you uh, two specific things. I'm going to show you how to build it using this WordPress plugin. Everybody keeps asking me, like, what plugin do I use? And so I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. And then I'm going to show you how to generate leads and actually sell featured listings because it seems like there's some some confusion there. But if you if you follow this step by step program, then you can build a profitable business directly for yourself. And I'll show you that this is exactly what I do. So let's check it out. For those of you who regularly follow my videos, this website should look very familiar. This is Sober Nation. This is one of my directories. And this is the website I'm going to use to show you the example of, of how I actually monetize and collect leads. So this website is a, a national resource. It's a national directory of drug and alcohol treatment centers for people that are looking for help. And for instance, this page right here, sobernation.com slash rehab slash New Jersey, this is the New Jersey page. So this page lists all of the facilities in New Jersey. And what I want you to look at is this top one right here. So this is what I'm actually selling. This is a featured listing. And I, I want to highlight this because one of the questions I've been getting over and over again is that they say, Tim, I don't get it, right? Like I don't, if I build a directory, I don't have any listings on it. So how am I supposed to sell listings on an empty directory? And I say, no, you give away the listings for free. And then they say, but if I give them away for free, how am I selling them? This is how you're doing it. So the listings are free and the listings are a way to fill up your category pages so that you can SEO them. And it's a way to make it so that your directory has value. And then you're going to use those listings to create leads. So hang on one second. I'll show you exactly what I mean. But first, I want you to know that this is your actual product. You're selling featured listings, or at least this is how I'm doing it. When you sell a featured listing, what you do is that listing itself becomes highlighted. So it stays at the top of the page and the listing itself has more value to it. So in this case, there's pictures, there's a lot more information. Okay, great. So you know what you're selling, but how exactly do you sell it, right? How do you get people interested in it? Well, that's what the free listings are for. So right here, addiction recovery systems, this is a free listing. I'm going to click on this listing. You can see that the listing is still plenty robust. It's still valuable. I'm not just creating listings that don't have any information on it. You want to you want to make something of this so that the people visiting your site can get the value that they're looking for. But at the bottom of the listing, look here, you see it says claim listing, make this a featured listing, add a regular listing. When you click on these, all of these go to a lead form. So this is how you do it. You create the free content to generate traffic and to generate interest from potential advertisers. And then the free content itself actually becomes your lead generation mechanism. So when a potential when a potential advertiser fills out this form, the lead is submitted into HubSpot. And so this is what the lead says. You can see the first name, last name, email address, phone number, the website URL, and then the message. I would like to add this particular recovery facility listing on Detox Local. So Detox Local is, is a website just like Sober Nation. It's another one of the, the lead gen sites we have. It's as simple as that you can see that the free listings still have value. They generate the leads and they help the user, but the free listings turn into featured listings. So just to show you that this works, we officially launched the feature listing directory two months ago, and I've already increased the revenue by $5,229 a month. I'm sure I'm going to sell more listings. I'm positive. I'm also sure some people are going to cancel. Uh, however, I fully expect this number to be closer to like an extra 20 grand a month in revenue. Um, I don't know, let's say by like September, I'm, I'm really confident that that's going to happen. And I'm really confident that it can happen for you as well, because I have replicated this exact system over and over and over again. I know it works. I know it generates leads. And I know that, that small businesses are willing to pay for this featured spot. 
Because if somebody is looking for drug rehabs in New Jersey and they come to this drug rehabs New Jersey page, well, this is the first one that they're going to see. And this is the most uh, highlighted listing. And this is the listing that has like the, the, the most visuals, the most information. So obviously, this one's going to attract the most attention. It's a clear business value add for the advertiser and for you. Okay, so you see how it works. You see what you're selling, you see how to collect leads, you see how to collect the inbound forms, you see that it clearly generates revenue. Now let's look at how to go about building it. So as I've gotten emails and inquiries from people asking, how do you build it? I tell them, use the business directory plugin. And then they say, which one? I'm like, no, that's literally what it's called. It's called the business directory plugin. So go to businessdirectoryplugin.com. This is a WordPress plugin. So you need a WordPress website. And then the the plugin is actually free. So you can you can build a free directory without having to pay for anything. The problem is you're not going to have the modules, you're not going to have the functionality that you need to make the directory monetize, but you can still get started for free, build a website, start adding these listings for free. If you're doing it manually, it's going to take you some time and at least you can build some momentum. And then when you're ready to monetize, uh, you simply... You, you, you add on modules and I will show you what that looks like right here. So this is actually an old website that I haven't touched in years. I still make like 40 bucks a month from it, from this AdSense, um, which is the only reason why I haven't deleted it. But this example is going to be a little bit janky just because the site's kind of broken. Nonetheless, you're, you're going to get an understanding as to what it looks like. So when you download the business directory plugin, um, this right here is is the plugin. So this is the home page. And so on your cat on your, the home page of your directory, so it'll be like url.com slash business dash directory. This is where you add your categories. And so you can make these categories whatever you want. You know, so for instance on Sobernation, all of my categories are location pages. Um, in this case, since excuse me, it's a, a local business directory, the location is only one thing. And so then, then the categories are, are are different business types that you want to use. You know, so for instance, I have advertising and marketing, beauty and personal care, contractors, family home services. I just put all these categories from uh, the the Google business directory. I just I literally Googled what are the Google business directory categories and then I put them in here. Uh, so that's how you do it. And then look, if I were to go to this category, these are the free listings that I added. So like I said, this is an old site. You can see that the pictures aren't lined up properly and it's like the code is pretty deprecated. Nonetheless, I hope you're seeing how it works. Okay, so great. Now, how do you add in the functionality to make it so that you can use your content to claim to generate leads? Well, this right here is the back end of Boca Digest, and this is the back end of the plugin. And so these are all the modules. So you're going to need this plugin. Uh, this is premium. This is basically how you get your license. Um, you're going to want this one. This is how you add maps on the feature listings. You're going to want this one, the Stripe payment, so that you can actually sell the listings. And you're going to want this one. The claim listings. I mean, there's value to all of them, right? If you want to give away discount codes, you can do that. If you want to do enhanced categories, you can do that. They're all pretty cool. Ratings are obviously very cool. So it's just up to you on how many of these modules that you want to upgrade. Nonetheless, you're going to need this one. You're definitely going to need this one because this is how you collect the leads. And then you're going to need this one so that you can actually make payments. So once you have the claims listing, the claim listing module on it, well, then the the listing itself is going to have just like I showed you on here. There's, it's going to have a button at the bottom that says claim listing. And so luckily, since this is all in a plugin, that claim listing button is going to send you leads directly into the back end of your, Word, of your WordPress site. It'll be um, somewhere in here in the directory plugin in WordPress. And so this way you're not going to need like a CRM or HubSpot or anything because that's all super expensive. All right. And so then you have uh, you, you have claims listings. And now since you have the business directory premium, you have the ability to create feature listings. And then you're collecting leads. You're pitching them on the price and you're selling them on feature listings. So now you have the same exact business model that worked 
for here on here. It's the same exact model over and over and over again, and it will work every single time. One more thing that I want to add is in time, you can create a widget that puts the feature listings through your blog posts. You know, so for instance, um, this is an old article. I mean, wow, 2019. That's so crazy that I haven't worked on this site since 2019. Uh, but you can create a widget that feeds the advertisers directly through the content, which makes your listings even more valuable because the majority of your traffic, if you're an SEO like me, is going to come through the blog. And what I hi highly recommend you do is obviously create an email signup form because then when somebody signs up for your email list, the automation that they get is, hey, are you a local business owner? Sign up for a feature listing. And so now you have the listings themselves, which are creating leads, your blog, which is creating leads, your email list, which is creating leads. So the reason why I love directory so much is because the marketing and the product are like the same exact thing. You know, it's just the traffic itself is the marketing and the traffic itself is the product. So it's a really unique model that flywheels well because the more web traffic you get, the more listings you sell, the more listings you sell, the more web traffic you get, the more web traffic you get, the more listings you sell. Uh, so you can see here that, I mean, look, this is, like I said, this is an old site. If we go to all time, when I was really working on it back in 2019, you know, I was getting like 2000 hits a day. Uh, however, like there's still traffic coming to this site. So one of the reasons, one of the other reasons why I really like this model is because if you spend time and really, really create great content, well, the content's going to stick around forever. It's not like being a creator where you need a Twitter account and a LinkedIn account and an email list and SEO, and you're just constantly, constantly, constantly having to feed the beast. Um, the, the blog posts are going to last forever. And as long as you continue to optimize this site, which as you can see, I have not done. <laughs> I mean, what are you going to do, right? I got, I got enough stuff going on, but I just... Man, I got to say a little side note. If there is a particular like directory model that I love, it's local. Just pick a city, start writing articles about that particular city, and then build a local business directory around the city. It's, it's just a winning idea. It's very simple. It's very profitable. And like one person can do it. Okay. Let me know if you have any questions. I've gotten so many inquiries about this that it's, it's getting to the point where I'm thinking about creating like... I don't know, a productized service or like a done for you business directory model where I can do this and I can manage it. And then the people can just create the content itself. And I don't know, maybe I'll work on like an equity share or a rev share or something. I, I don't necessarily know. I just, I'm so shocked as to how many people want to learn more about directories. And I'm making these videos because I want you to see how, um, it, it takes hard work, but it's, it's such an applicable, pragmatic model because Local businesses need more customers. Local businesses need more awareness. People, especially for like the local scene, uh, people like to know what's going on in their cities and their towns. And there's always going to be a need for more customers, right? So it's not like this is a model that's going to be kind of fly by night and it's going to disappear in time. Let me know if you have any questions. Please leave a comment. Please smash that subscribe button. And I'll talk to you next week. All right. See ya.